All right, intro video tract 29 at Cave Hollow. Beautiful property, uh, 11 acre tract. It's outlined in gray right here. It borders the easement road along its entire south side. That's the purple line. Uh, goes northerly, it has this creek bed that's called Little Creek that crosses over the center of the property uh, and then continues several hundred feet beyond that. So why don't we first of all, we'll just really quickly here, we'll zoom out, we'll show you where this is within Cave Hollow. Okay, so over toward the left, we've got Highway 5. Um, to get to the property, you will take the, the entrance or the easement road off of Highway 5, which is right here where this little Mickey Mouse hand is. Immediately go right, so you're running parallel with the highway, and then it branches off and goes northeasterly, uh, kind of follows a ridge to the south side of the property. It dead ends just a few hundred yards after the property, so extremely, extremely private. And let's zoom in and we'll take a look. First, we want to look at a topo map. Okay. So property is where you come in on the easement road on, on the south side. Uh, it's basically the highest on the south side. Slopes down as you go uh, toward the creek bed. Uh, this whole basically middle section is roughly level other than it does have the, the creek bed running through it. And then as you go north from there, it slopes back up and you actually have what appears to be a, a pretty good sized level area on the northeast side. Now these topo maps, they're interesting. These were um, made by the government Generally, in the, in the 40s and 50s, we've been told these particular maps, this white area, the green areas are indicating uh, that that section was wooded when the maps were made. The white areas are indica indicating that that section was open, like probably a meadow. So this particular tract, apparently many years ago, had some type of meadow on it. And oftentimes when we switch into a different aerial, well, yeah, you can see that. Look where those cedar trees are. This is a wintertime aerial. Uh, so you've got hardwoods with no leaves, you've got cedars that are green, and keep your eye on that, that uh, grove of, of cedar trees as we switch back to the, the vintage topo map. That's basically the white area. So that, that was open at some point, um, so potentially that could be cleaned up again, um, made into a, a, a building site or meadow or pasture or whatnot. So the thing to keep in mind on this site is you do have the easement road. Um, it stays level for, for just a little while going north from the easement road and then it slopes down. And actually as you get in a little bit, it slopes aggressively. If you look at how close these lines are, that's gonna be fairly steep, it's gonna be very steep. Uh, so if you wanted to create a trail down to the creek and across, you would likely, if, if you were to hire someone with a piece of equipment, they would likely come in uh, toward one of the corners and then just kind of make a, a trail or a road diagonally going down to get into that area and then ultimately to get if you wanted to, back up here. I mean, this would probably be a, a very nice site here on the northeast. You'd have a view. It looks level. Um, you do have setbacks off the easement roads at Cave Hollow, so you've got to get 100 feet off this easement road before you do anything uh, as far as parking or storage or building or camping or anything like that. Uh, so keep that in mind. Uh, but the, the creek, it's gorgeous. When we were out there doing drone videos, it was running beautifully. Uh, this particular, actually in, in this aerial, it looks like it's running. But keep in mind, this is not a year-round creek. We've been out there when, there when the creek has not been running. It might have had some pools of water in it, but we have definitely been out there when the creek has not been running. So uh, don't plan on using that for a water source for yourself, your animals, or whatever, because um, it, uh, it would not be good for that. <laughs> uh, as we go back to, I want to go to a topo. The topo map shows it splitting toward the east side of the property. When we look at the Google Aerial, it looks like it actually splits and then starts to come together on the east side and then splits again. Uh, so interesting. It's a beautiful, beautiful creek bed. If you haven't already seen the videos, be sure to check that out. Fun to play with the different base maps. It's a heavily wooded property. I mean, you've got um, probably some small natural openings, but it's basically 99% wooded from what we can tell here. Gorgeous tract. Uh, it's a big one. A lot of opportunity on this one. Uh, track 29 at Cave Hollow.